G'day guys, Corey here from Designs by FR. Today we have something a bit different for you guys. We were contacted by a company called Yulifone. They sent out their Armor 10 5G and we're gonna give that away to one of you lucky guys over on our Discord server. I'll give you guys more details throughout the video. Now guys, I'll be the first to admit I am a PC guy. I don't normally look at phones, but for the sake of getting some extra cool stuff for you guys, we took on this project. So let's go ahead and unbox this phone and we'll see what it can do. The Yulifone Armor 10 5G is the world's first 5G rugged smartphone. Comes with a full HD 6.67 inch IPS display, which is super responsive. On the rear, it has a 64 megapixel quad camera with a five megapixel macro lens, eight megapixel ultra wide, and a two megapixel bokeh lens. And for those gorgeous selfies, we have a 16 megapixel front camera. For storage, we have eight gigabytes of RAM with 128 gigabytes of onboard storage. There is 5,800 milliamps of battery life with wireless charging available. This phone actually lasted us two days with regular use. The phone weighs 335 grams and is actually very large compared to our Samsung Galaxy Note 9. This thing is rugged. And by that, I mean drop resistant, waterproof, dustproof, and scratch resistant as well. At the back of the phone, it also has a rear mounted fingerprint sensor. There is no headphone jack, however, there is a USB Type-C to headphone jack cable included, so you can listen to music. The speakers on the phone are fairly good, however, they are located at the back. The thing is, if you want to watch videos or movies and have your phone laying down, this could change the sound a little, depending on the surface it's laying on. Now one thing that really interests me, being a content creator, is how well the camera actually functions. Now you guys know for me, I like to film my PC build, so let's go ahead, grab this phone, and see how well the camera performs. So using the back 64 megapixel 4K camera, we can see the image color is absolutely fantastic. Now when I was walking around, I noticed the image stabilization could use a bit of work. It is very, very jagged when we're moving around. So there's definitely some improvements to be made. We also went in for some close-up autofocusing testing. You can see that the autofocus is pretty smooth. It almost focuses instantly, making it a really nice autofocusing camera. The image quality is nice and sharp, but again, with the, all of that motion blur going on, the video quality doesn't really look pleasing to the eye apart from the colors. Again, we tested the front selfie camera and this time the color was just not there. It looks so washed out and faded. There was no image stabilization. Focusing was okay, but the picture quality overall was just not there. So guys, that about does it for this video. If you'd like a shot at winning this phone, visit discord.gg forward slash IFR. Go ahead and find the giveaway free loot tab and you'll find out how to enter. Now I know this wasn't an in-depth review, we just wanted to touch on some of the features, show you guys the camera, and organize an awesome giveaway for you guys. So I hope you all enjoyed the video, remember to leave a like and consider subscribing, and let us know if you want more giveaways like this one. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you all in the next one.